This tutorial is a brief introduction to the features and use of WinWizard 3.5. Win provides assistance for reading, studying, and writing. For example, it can assist users with reading printed materials such as pamphlets, as well as reading text in word processing documents, web pages, and Adobe PDF documents. Win also includes writing support for word processing, email, and filling out forms. Win is best suited for individuals who have difficulty with reading or who would benefit from study and writing tools. It is especially useful for individuals who need access to printed documents that are not available in electronic formats. However, Win does not provide screen reading functions for menus and toolbars and may not be appropriate for people who are blind or visually impaired. Screen reading software is available to users needing this type of support. In this demonstration, we will go over some useful features of WIN, including how to scan a printed document and have that document read out loud, and how to use study and writing tools such as the dictionary, a thesaurus, and tools for organizing text. To get started, locate the WIN icon in the Accessibility folder and double-click on it. If prompted to select a speech engine, choose IBM via Voice Text-to-Speech, then select OK. By default, Win has four toolbars, some buttons such as Read, Pause, Exact View, Text View, and other docs are available on all the toolbars. The blue file management toolbar includes options for scan, create, open, close, print, and save documents, and options to access email and the internet. The green reading styles toolbar is used to change the visual and audio presentation of documents. Use this toolbar to change options such as text size, text and background color, and speech rate. The pink study toolbar provides options to highlight text, view a list of highlighted or bookmarked words, spell words out loud, and access the dictionary and thesaurus. The yellow writing toolbar supports basic word processing functions such as cut and paste text, create and work with an outline, enable, disable word prediction, check your spelling, and apply bold, italic, and underline to text. For this demonstration, we are using the standard public access custom toolbar, which supports many commonly used features in Win. To set up a custom toolbar from the settings menu, choose custom toolbar and select the buttons you wish to include. For information on other toolbars and features not covered in this tutorial, visit the where to get additional information section of this tutorial. By default, Win has four toolbars, some buttons such as Read, Pause, Exact View, Text View, and Other Docs are available on all the toolbars. The blue file management toolbar includes options for scan, create, open, close, print, and save documents, and options to access email and the internet. The green reading styles toolbar is used to change the visual and audio presentation of documents. Use this toolbar to change options such as text size, text and background color, and speech rate. The pink study toolbar provides options to highlight text, view a list of highlighted or bookmarked words, spell words out loud, and access the dictionary and thesaurus. The yellow writing toolbar supports basic word processing functions such as cut and paste text, create and work with an outline, enable, disable word prediction, check your spelling, and apply bold, italic, and underline to text. For this demonstration, we are using the standard public access custom toolbar, which supports many commonly used features in Win. To set up a custom toolbar from the settings menu, choose custom toolbar and select the buttons you wish to include. For information on other toolbars and features not covered in this tutorial, visit the where to get additional information section of this tutorial. Let's begin using Win by reading a document out loud. Win can read the text in most documents, including word processing handouts, Adobe PDF, internet documents, and basic text files, as well as files that have been scanned and saved within Win. To open a document, select the Open button on the toolbar or press Ctrl plus O on the keyboard. Click on the document you wish to read. Now, select the Read button or press F2 on the keyboard. Win reads the document aloud, highlighting each word as it is spoken. Flower parts. Flowers are important in making seeds. Click the pause button or press the space bar to stop reading. Before we continue, notice that all buttons on the toolbar are toggle buttons. Each button displays what action Win will take when that button is pressed. This is different from many programs which display the current state of the button. 
So, for example, when Wynn is reading out loud, the pause button is displayed. Then when reading is stopped by clicking pause, the read button is displayed, indicating the next action to be taken using that button. While reading, you can change the text size by clicking the size button. You can also change the speaking rate by clicking the rate button. Faster. Faster. Fastest. Slowest. When working with a document, Win provides tools for basic editing. For example, use the cut, copy, paste button to cut, copy, or paste text from one place in the document to another or from one document to another. Win can scan and read printed documents such as pamphlets and flyers if a scanner has been connected to the computer. First, place a document face down on the scanner bed and close the cover. Don't worry about whether the text is oriented vertically or horizontally on the scanner. Win can figure it out and will adjust accordingly. Click the scan button on the toolbar or press F3 on the keyboard to begin the scan. While the page is being scanned, a dialog box indicates that Win is processing the page. To cancel scanning before the page is complete, click the Cancel button on the dialog box. There may be a slight delay before Win interrupts the scanning process. During scanning, all other buttons and menu items will be unavailable. To scan additional pages, repeat the previous steps. Each new page will be automatically inserted following the page where the cursor is located. When Win has finished scanning and processing the text on a page, that page will be displayed. This is called Text View. The Text View button toggles to Exact View. Exact View displays the document in its original form with all graphics, tables, etc. To have Win read information out loud from a web page, click on the Go to Web button, then open a web page. Click on the Read button to read the text and links on the page. Home. About us. Product and services. Support. When you are finished using the internet, Select the Close the Web button or press Alt plus C on the keyboard. Win allows the users to switch among open documents at any time. Suppose you are reading a web page and then want to make notes in another document you have open. Click on the Other Docs button. Click on Go to Web button again to return to the web page. Win provides a full range of tools to assist users with reading comprehension and writing. For example, you can look up a word and its synonyms while reading text in a document or while browsing the Internet. To do this, select a word by using the mouse or arrow keys. Click on the Dictionary button and choose the Standard Dictionary. Switch from the Dictionary to the Thesaurus using the Switch to Synonyms button or press Shift F4 on the keyboard. To switch back to the Dictionary, select the Switch to Definition button or press F4 on the keyboard. To hear the definitions or synonyms read out loud, click the Read Next button. Win will read one definition Adjective. or synonym at a time, moving forward through the list. Select Read Previous Incorrect. to hear the previous definition or synonym. To look up any of these words, right-click on the word and then select Look Up Word. Choose the Close button or press Alt plus C on the keyboard to close the dictionary. Win allows the users to highlight text in a document and then extract that text into another document. This function is similar to highlighting lines in a book for note-taking. Click on the Highlight button to open a drop-down menu with options for a green, blue, or pink highlighter and an eraser. For this demonstration, we will select the green highlighter. The mouse pointer will now act like a highlighter pen, highlighting text whenever you hold down the left mouse button while sweeping over the text. Repeat this action each time you find information which should be included in your notes. To use the eraser, drag it over the highlighted text to remove the highlighting. The List button allows the users to create a new document containing only the previously highlighted text. Click on List to choose how highlighted text will be displayed. Choices are by Highlight Order, which creates a new document with only the highlighted text from the original document listed in order and by Highlight Color, which creates a new document with green text first, blue text next, and pink text last. Users then add additional notes by typing them into the document. For additional information on Win, click the Help menu and select Win Help. You may want to visit the Win Overview section, which covers basic features and introduces many other features the program provides, including other toolbar functions. 
For more information on Win Wizard, visit the Freedom Scientific website at http colon slash slash www.freedomscientific.com. This educational video was developed by the Washington Assistive Technology Alliance.